this is what I wake up to this morning. Hi. Hi. up to a text message from my manager asking if I could close tonight and I can count all the times I've personally said no to a shift because I honestly don't say a mistletoe um what was I saying oh yeah I, I can personally count the times that I've said no, I don't say no very often. I usually always say yes just because I am not usually doing anything. And also, I've learned that in the past, if I had plans, like today I have plans, sometimes I would cancel my plans just to go to work. <laughs> what? Nothing, I'm just laughing at you. Never mind, chase the squirrel. Wow, well, that was a big squeak. Hopefully we can fix this hair situation because, bitch. You like that? Thank you. Oh, don't tell me. I honestly don't think I'm gonna do my makeup. Like, I thought I was going to, but now I'm like, I I am I really going to? Usually, I do not do my makeup on my days off just because I have to wear, I have to wear makeup for my one job. So, I don't like wearing it, honestly, that much. So, I'm probably gonna go back to bed for like half an hour. <laughs> Come on. Oh my god, oh my god. Okay, no. Let's just relax. Yeah, relaxing. Let's get the blankies on. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. Okay, goodbye. Bye under there. At least my hair is done. That's what matters. I feel like the hair makes you put what hair makes you put what why do I keep saying that hair makes you look put to ow you're hurting me put together for my outfit just super basic comfortable I just have these knee-high boots they do have a built-in heel into them I have um long johns on because it's cold. I also have my Lululemon pants on. I have a shirt and then just a thick-ish kind of sweater because again it's cold. I'm gonna have my coat also bring mitts and stuff like that. It's always colder downtown compared to the rest of the world. I don't know. I feel like it should be warmer because of all the buildings but I'm pretty sure it's the opposite. I fixed my hair as best as possible and we're just gonna rock and roll with it because I just can't be bothered. And then I'm gonna bring my backpack. Whenever I go into the city from now on, it is just so much easier to have everything in a backpack rather than 
carry purse because it gets heavy. Every every time I like do my hair, I always need to like spray something into it because I hate that like I just burnt the shit out of my hair. Like smell when you do it, you know? Ugh, disgusting. I had about a five to ten minute period where I could not find my phone. I thought I was gonna miss the train. Luckily, I made it. Picture perfect, wonderland. <laughs> oh, the dog is so cute. Touch it. <laughs> <laughs> it's so pretty. Soup is pretty. Soup's pretty. <laughs> that's what Zach and I say. Oh, yeah, Soup's Zach pretty. Is so cute. Thank you. This is super cute. Why have I never been over here? Because you don't go oh, no. out on adventures. No. <laughs> I feel like we had to go the other way. Are you kidding me? We just went over. Oh my god! We were supposed to go the other way. Oh my god. Turning back around. <laughs> now, another girl that was supposed to close tonight texted me asking to take her shift, and I was like, hey, I'm in what Toronto. What do you mean, what? It's in this center, and it's telling me go all the way around. It's like right there, it's behind this fucking building. So we gotta figure okay. out how to get behind there. <laughs> what do you mean? Just like around the block? It's, it's behind, behind this building. It's probably on the other side of the block. Like the entrance? Yeah. We're fine. We'll be fine. <laughs> Let's just try. Sorry, continue your story. That's not kind of strange. Yeah, so I was like, I can't take it. I was like, I'm in Toronto. I am really nervous. I had a coffee, but I had to throw half of it away because I just, the nerves are kicking in. <laughs> <laughs> to choose from. Okay. Take a peek see. in the mirror. I'm like closer. I'll touch it. Like <laughs> I can't see it. You want it closer to the ridge? Yeah, but not yeah, like there. Maybe like a little lower. Lower? Yeah. Take it. <laughs> no, I'm in your way, so just knock me You're out. You're gonna look that way towards that beautiful garbage can. <laughs> it is actually pretty beautiful. Right? What did I say? What did I say? Oh, it's gonna be easier for you. Okay. Here, good. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. That's it. Not even two seconds. Yeah. Yeah. This is easy. Perfect. Perfect. Anything yet? No. The ball's too boring for me. I'm gonna have it for four months. I can even take care of it. It makes four months on forever. It is. <laughs> Did you happen to take any Advil today? I haven't. I think it's a leader. That's okay. Because also, like, my nipple, I had to go back and get them to clean it up again because it was just too much. Yeah. Conches do tend to swell quite a bit, so you're going to notice the bar is quite long. Okay. It will swell. Um, 
as soon as your swelling is down, you can come in and we can downsize the bar. It's probably going to be at least two months. Okay. That's it. Okay. Good. Bravo, darling. I'm going to let your ear settle for a minute. We'll okay. do your friend's piercing okay. and then I'll clean you up a little bit more after that again. Okay. Um, I'm blood. <laughs> Is this still recording? Yeah. I'm more nervous than piercing. This is my first one. No, you your ear is done. <laughs> it, I don't feel it. That's why. So you're fine. You probably don't remember getting your ears pierced. Oh no, I was 12 years old. Oh. You remember. Yeah, <laughs> I remember. <laughs> I couldn't sleep on any of my sides. Oh. Yeah. I, was, I wasn't a baby when I got them. Like, yeah, me neither. My mom waited. And all. Yeah. Yeah, that's why this one's so far down. Apparently I moved. Oh. Yeah, if you just want me to do it where I see it? Yeah. yeah. I have no circulation in my hands. <laughs> Butterflies and Steven and I wish I could have I was. I don't know. That's it. See? It wasn't even bad at all. I told you. <laughs> That's uh, okay. <laughs> Didn't listen. Yeah. <laughs> You're always a little bit more nervous. You build it up more in your head. Right? Yeah. I feel like sometimes that's better because then it's not as bad. Yeah. Oh my god. My everyday problem. Baby, my hair's never It's gone. It's time to do it. You're all good. Easy, easy. <laughs> what are those pins for? For clothes? Clothes yeah. pins? There we go. Um, it just feels like that on your ear. Sounds yeah. Good. Just go. cut it off or pull it in. Oh god. That <laughs> just, just doesn't sound good. <laughs> Let's not do that. <laughs> so I just gotta pop your ball on the top and you're done. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna Is fix it, my Am clothes. I bleeding as much as her? No. no. You're not what the frick? What's wrong with you? Okay. This is what Janine got. Okay, so this is nigiri, edamame, seaweed. I don't know what's in this sushi, but this is cucumber and miso, miso soup. soup. And my drink! And then I got Greek. Of course. <laughs> okay. I love how we got our nationality. I know, yeah. The line for Greek food was like, it was like bim bam boom bam. So fast, so efficient. I was like, oh my god. Wow. Crazy. So we changed my earrings. We went to Aldo and I got some other studsies and they matched this one so much better. Mm -hmm. Ignore the blood. <laughs> <laughs> I have to deal with that when I get home, she said. We're about to go outside so I have like my scarf on, ready to rock and roll. We are gonna go to the distillery district, Christmas market to go kind of explore. 
And then I think we're just gonna leave. Maybe spend like an hour or two there and just go home. Fun little thing that happened for hours. For a whole hour. Um, they can probably see me in the reflection. Yeah. We went to Nathan Phillips Square. There was like a little... We didn't even go to the Christmas market I know. like we planned. We, my hair, I'm sorry. We went <laughs> to Nathan Phillips Square. There was like a little Christmas, uh, there was a big Christmas tree there. We're like, oh my God, so cute. Yeah. And then this guy came up to us. He's like, hey, you have a lighter. <laughs> and we were literally with him. And I just started and a, talking. And a girl for hours. Yeah. And we got their numbers hours. and stuff. And it was so much fun. I went Following to Insta. Insta. Yeah, they went to Tim Hortons. I feel like there are soulmates, like, like low key. <laughs> yeah, low key soulmates, just because we we got along so well, like really quickly. You know, so yeah, weird. like it was like one of those like, oh my god, I have to see you again. Yeah, like especially her. She's, yeah, I love she her. Was super sweet. Yeah, so now we're waiting for the train. So we already missed the first, the other train. <laughs> she was like dying because I was like, I like hug him really fast. I was like, boy, <laughs> gotta go. I feel like I need to be up here. There you go. <laughs> yeah, so she like tackled him and then we tried to meet the train and then it was just I leaving, was leaving. I was as like... soon as we got here. Today is the first snowfall in December. Okay, so today I was planning on getting four piercings. I was planning on getting this one and then a triple forward helix. But the girl, Katie from Village Inc. was amazing. Definitely recommend her. Um, she's like, honestly, I don't recommend it. Like, I think they should just do one at a time, heal, blah, blah, blah. Come back in a couple of months and deal with them. She's like, you've never had cartilage piercings before, which I haven't. But just if they all heal properly, she's like, I don't want to just take your money and just do that and I was like honestly I respect that so I was like okay fine I'll just do the one I was honestly really set on a triple forward helix for the longest time right here I've wanted it for a couple of years my friend Stephanie has it she was the one that I went to go visit in Alberta I definitely still want to get like one or two on this side just to kind of like I don't know even them out a bit um, I think I'm actually gonna go with a double forward helix I will definitely be doing a video about this um, probably after Vlogmas, just so it has like a little bit of time to heal. It might be like my first video back from Vlogmas maybe. Or maybe I'll do like one beauty video and then the conch. Fashion. <laughs> so I am going to hop into the shower to give this a rinsey rinse because that's what she told me to do when I got home. Um, I definitely don't want to. I'm hella tired. I still have to edit this video. But she told me to do it, so I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna listen. I'm gonna be a good girl. She told me that it could take up to like 10 minutes. What she told me to do was hold like this and kind of have like some gaps going on so that water can run through and rinse it and rinse it and rinse it. I'm not supposed to touch it of course. Blah blah blah. Honestly I'm not sure if just one rinse is really gonna like rinse it clean. So some of it came out. Most of it did not. So I am going to take a q-tip with the saline solution and hopefully the shower at least softened it so hopefully it will come off really easily if it doesn't i'm not gonna pick at it because obviously you're not supposed to but like i like i can't let it just sit there for like days on end you know so so that's just how i'm gonna leave it for now and then i'll show you the back So obviously also have some crusting there, some bruising. I am just here editing. Uh, I'm not very far into it. Edited content, I have five minutes and 44 seconds, but I'm literally falling asleep. Super tired, I'm having a really hard time keeping my eyes open. So I'm just gonna have to finish this tomorrow. And yeah, sorry about it. Thank you so much for watching. Buddy's under the blankets, as you can see. As per usual, he says goodbye. And we'll catch you tomorrow.